Good morning fellas, welcome back to another Villa on Tour video today. We're back, the international break is over, so all the international football. We're back at Villa Park today. Wolves are our opponents, the West Midlands derby. We say it every time, is it a derby, is it not? Depends where you're from, depends where your mates are, um, etc. But not for me, I don't really care. Um, but Wolves, they're a decent side actually, although they had a slow start to the season. They've picked up, they've won their last games, uh, last two games against Southampton and Newcastle I believe. So, you know, they're picking up a little bit. It's a bit of a transition season for Wolves, you know. I don't really know where they're going to come. I think they'll be fairly similar to Villa this season probably um, you know going for that mid table both trying to get top 10. Villa on the other hand um, yeah not really a great result against Tottenham before the international break go and check that video out if you haven't already um, but we should be getting back to it I think we, we need to pick up the performance because it just simply wasn't good enough. Um, still no Bailey which is just really disappointing I don't know if Martinez is going to be back Louise as well because they're away in South America during the international break but we shall see uh, appreciate the brand new shirt by the way um, 2009-2010 away shirt I don't know what name to get on the back though, I might get Milner, uh, but let me know in the comments. Just before we carry on though, please do go and check out Luke1977, use the code MAX20 for a big fat 20% discount on almost anything there, top link in the description, 20% off using the code MAX20, bosh. Um, without further ado, let's get to Villa Park, absolutely buzzing, full house up the villa. Ooh, classic shirt, Luke. I know you're asking where the jacket's from. Uh, max 20 for 20% off. And while we're on the uh, theme of plugs, please do leave a like on the video, a thousand likes if you can. And uh, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Check out Villa on Tour Shorts, actually. I haven't promoted that yet. Um, it's basically like a shorts channel where, like, if a goal goes in, any good chance from the games, I'll upload that. Just like a short 30 second to a minute clip. And that is on Villa on Tour Shorts, that YouTube channel. So there will be a link in the description. Go and check it out. Um, so many channels, oh my God. And um, without further ado, up the villa. What's the score prediction today, Mace? Probably 2-1 Villa. 2 1 Villa. Who's gonna score the goals? Uh, Ings and Watkins. Ings and Watkins. Give us not the villa. Not the villa. I can't do it. Hey? What is the score prediction today, Robin lad? I'm gonna go 3-1. 3-1? 3-1, aren't we? Nah, 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 nah. Jamie, what are we saying, son? Uh, it's got 1-0 written all over. 1-0, I've said that. Away, though, so I'm not gonna call it. Good man. Five, seven, eight, three, right then, chat. Um, big game. I like the team actually. He's still with five at the back, but he's got Buendia back in there. Ramsey's come out. I don't mind that at all. Excited to see what Buendia can do. I'll go 1 0 Villa today. I want to see Ings get the goal. I'm going to go Danny Ings 1 0 Villa. But I don't know. I like what he's done with the team, taking Ramsey out. I just like what he's done there, but he's stuck with the five. Um, so hopefully, we can get something done today against the Wolves. Come on, the Villa. Jesus. Oh, <laughs> Hello mate, how are you? I'm alright, how are you? I'm good mate, oh, what, what, are you, what are you feeling um, today son? Well, it's all week I've gone 1-1, one, 1-1, one, 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 Safe. One. Safe. Safe. I've got to go a little bit positive then I. I'll go 2-1 Villa. 2-1? Both teams are playing 5 back, so it might be a really boring game, which obviously pushes me towards 1-1, one, one, but I'll go 2-1 Villa because we need to beat these, like really, they're rubbish. He's confident, that's rubbish. dangerous, that's two dangerous. One, Villa. Come on! Oh! 
Tottenham again, yeah. lads. Great work. <laughs> One nil. Danny, Danny Ings, Danny Ings, Danny, Danny Ings. La, 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 la. Danny, Danny Ings, Danny Ings, Danny, Danny Ings. We travel here and far. You can never sing What a handsome devil. Everything today has gone through him. He's been unbelievable. He's deserved that. John McGinn, come on. Wake up, McGinn. Super John McGinn. Just don't think I'm stuck. Morning. Um, I've taken my time to reflect on what the hell we just saw. Uh, Wolves fans, I hope you've enjoyed the video. I'm sure you have. Um, it's still a little bit salty on the Villa side of things, but pff, what can you do? It's one of them games. It's outrageous on Villa that we've thrown that away. Two nil up with ten minutes to go, and thrown it. It's, it's just mental. I think the first goal. It comes from Neves, I think credit to Neves, it's an unbelievable pass and again it's just simple square across the box. Um, the second goal again I think comes from a corner, annoying, Austin McPhee, have a word. Um, it's annoying because whenever we do well from a corner, Austin McPhee gets the praise, but whenever we slip up it's always Dean Smith's fault. Give your head a wobble if you if you Dean Smith out on all that nonsense. What well, was the third goal? The third goal's just stupid, I think. No, the second goal was stupid because it came off the post and then Adama does all his fancy stuff and then they just, just like, ramble it in. It's just stupid. Um, the winner is just taking the mick, isn't it? I mean, I don't know if the free kick's going in or not. It's not the best free kick I've ever seen. It comes off Matt Target's side and just absolutely dribbles in. I mean, it just rolls in and you just know as soon as it comes off Matt Target's side, that's going in. Wolves fans go mental as people on the pitch. Not good. I think it's good to see Danny Ings get a goal. Hopefully that gives him a bit of firepower to go uh, forward and go on a bit of a, of a run. Um, but not ideal. Not ideal at all, chaps. And uh, it's really disappointing. Everyone having to go to Dean Smith. As soon as it happened yesterday, your new Twitter was going to be a disgrace. Um, but hopefully we can go again on Friday at Arsenal. Um, leave a like on the video if you have enjoyed it. Wolves fans, share the video around. I know the content of your win is quite good, um, so share that around. Um, check out Luke1977, use code MAX20 for 20% off. And I shall see you on Friday for Arsenal away at the Villa. <laughs>